Hello, I'm Colin Hanrady from Hostelworld.com and if you want to know what are the most famous parks in the Catalonian capital, where's a good place to go for tapas, and when you can catch this light show, go nowhere because here are 10 things you need to know about Barcelona. Famous for its innovative architecture, celebrated football team and charming neighbourhoods, it's not hard to see why Barcelona is one of Europe's most visited destinations. You could easily spend a week in this amazing city, enjoying the sunshine, soaking up the atmosphere, seeing what goes on after dark and checking out its huge number of attractions. Now, here is the first of those 10 things. Barcelona is the capital of a state known as Catalonia. It has its very own flag and a language called Catalonian, which you can see on the street signs. And one of the most important buildings here is Parliament of Catalonia, here in Parque de la Ciutadella. This is the building where the regional parliament sits. While you'll do lots of walking in Barcelona, you will need to use the city's metro at some stage. There are stations all over the city, and the lines are distinguishable by both number and colour. A single ticket on Barcelona's metro will cost you around €1.50, but rather than buying individual tickets for each journey, buy yourself a T10 that costs about €8 Euro and will give you 10 journeys. Many of Barcelona's most famous attractions are designed by the same person, Antoni Gaudi. The best known include Casa Batlo and Passage de Gracia and La Pedrera, which is just across the road from it, while the main lamppost in Plaza Real was also designed by him. Ironically though, Gaudi never got to finish his most famous work, which is this, La Sagrada Familia. Work began on it in 1882 and the following year Gaudi was commissioned to finish it. Sadly though, he passed away before it was complete. And when will it be finished? Well that is the most asked question in the whole of Barcelona. Along with the works of Antoni Gaudi, there is lots more to see in Barcelona. These include the Picasso Museum which documents the work of the famous artist, the city's cathedral which dates back to the 13th century and Musée d'Historique de Catalogne which tells the history of the state. Another thing you can't miss is Font Magica de Montjuic which takes place at the fountain here in Plata Carlos Buigas near Plata de España in Montjuic. The show goes on for two hours so you should try to catch at least some of it when you're here. Barcelona has two parks which are perfect for visiting when you want to get away from it all. The first of these is Parque de la Ciutadella which can be found about 10 minutes east of La Rambla. It is here you will find paths for walking and the famous fountain known as the Cascada. The other is Gaudi's Park well located just north of the city centre. This huge park is full of beautifully landscaped gardens and Gaudi's trademark curves, like in the park's famous tiled bench, Bank de Trencadis. It is in this park that you will also find a much photographed mosaic dragon. All over Barcelona you will see restaurants advertising tapas, which is a Spanish delicacy where the food is served in small portions. If you're on a tight budget, a great place to go for tapas is Camp Paxiono down in Carrera de la Reina Cristiana in the La Barcelona Eta area of the city. Now the quality of tapas might not be as good as in other places, but that's not why people come here. They come here for these. The bottles of rosé cava that will cost you only four euro once you buy a portion of tapas. Salud. Salud.
Barcelona is where you will find one of Europe's most famous streets known as La Rambla. Broken up into five different sections, attractions along it include the famous Teatro de la Sue, which dates back to 1847, and the colourful Mercat de San Josep de la Boqueria. Another thing you will find along Las Ramblas are lots and lots of street performers. <laughs> Throughout the day you can see human statues and street performers of all kinds on this famous street. The locals here are extremely passionate about their football club FC Barcelona, known locally simply as Barca. And this is the home of Barcelona Football Club Camp Nou, or in English the New Camp. When it's full, it seats over 95,000 people, and football greats who have played here in the past include Holland's Johan Cruyff, Brazil's Romario, and arguably the most famous player the world has ever seen, Argentina's Diego Maradona. If you are in Barcelona and the weather is as good as it is today, don't forget that the beach is only 15 minutes walk from Las Ramblas. Thousands flock here every day during the summer months. The city also has its very own port and one of its most famous shopping centres, known as Mara Magnum, is also on the water. Barcelona has lots of intriguing neighbourhoods. The Barry Gothic is the city's old town and is full of narrow lanes to explore. North of the city you'll find Gracia, which is where to go to get away from the crowds, while Exempla is a huge neighbourhood known for its architecture and busy boulevards. This is Passage Elborn, which is the heart and soul of the Elborn district. It's found just east of Las Ramblas and is famously one of the best areas for nightlife in Barcelona. So if you're going to come here, make sure it's after dark. Another neighbourhood worth visiting after dark is Port Olympic, where you'll find lots of bars and restaurants. So that is our 10 things you need to know about Barcelona.